If you didn't get your stimulus check or got the wrong amount, there's still hope. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how you can still claim that money in 2021. That's right guys, as crummy as 2020 was, there's still a possibility that you can get this money in 2021. Now the stakes are even higher now because a new stimulus package just passed that will give $600 per adult and $600 per child. And most likely if you didn't get the first stimulus back in March, you're probably not gonna get this stimulus check either. Now there are several reasons why you may have been left out of the stimulus back in March. It may be because you didn't work in 2018 or 19, or maybe you missed the self-registration deadline if you were unemployed. Maybe you didn't have a direct deposit set up, or maybe your address was wrong and the IRS sent your check somewhere else. Or maybe you got the wrong amount and you had a child born in 2020 and the IRS didn't know about it. It doesn't really matter what the reason is, as long as you meet the income requirements, you qualify for this stimulus money. Now just a reminder, in order to qualify for the full stimulus check, you had to have made less than $75,000 a year if you're single or $150,000 a year if you're married. It phases out completely if you made $99,000 or more if you're single and $198,000 or more if you're married. Now in order to qualify for the stimulus, these income levels are actually based off your 2020 income despite them looking at your 2018 and 2019 tax returns. What this means is all these stimulus checks that people are getting right now are actually advances on their 2020 tax return. That's great news because that means that you can still claim these credits on a 2020 tax return. The IRS actually calls this the recovery rebate credit and they have a whole article explaining how you can claim this credit still on your 2020 tax return. Essentially all you have to do is file a 2020 tax return using a 1040 or a 1040 SR if you're a senior. Even if you made no income, that's right, if you made no income, you still qualify for this stimulus check. Remember, this stimulus check is supposed to be going to all Americans that meet that income threshold. So if you made no income, you still qualify for this stimulus. Now this credit is actually a refundable tax credit, and what that means is you don't have to owe any taxes to claim this credit. So even if you made no income and you owe no taxes, when you file your tax return and you claim this credit, they will actually owe you this money back. So all you have to do is just go and file a tax return. Head over to H&R Block, go online, do whatever you need to do to file a tax return. That way you can get this stimulus check still. Now I actually tested this out already on freetaxusa.com on my computer over here and I can confirm that you will actually get this money back when you file your taxes. I actually put fake information in just to see what it would do and it actually said that it owed me $1,200 from this recovery credit. Now for some of you guys, you may have got a check but maybe you got the wrong amount this is your chance to fix the IRS's mistake by filling out this information in your tax return. Another example of this is if you had a child in 2020, the IRS doesn't know about this baby yet because you've never claimed them on your tax return. Technically, that child also qualifies for an additional $500 in the first CARES Act and also $600 in the latest stimulus package. So when you guys file your taxes, make sure you guys are filling out that recovery rebate credit section. That way you get the right amount. Now once you fill out all this information, you should be seeing an additional credit on your tax return. If you owe taxes, it's just going to reduce the tax that you owe. If you don't owe any taxes, then it's going to increase your refund. So essentially this is how you can get your stimulus. And that's all there is to it guys, you just have to go and file a tax return. I just want to reiterate this again just so that it's clear for you guys. If you didn't make any income or you didn't work or you got the wrong amount that you were entitled to, make sure you guys go and file a tax return. For those of you who did not work, file a tax return. It still makes sense to file a tax return even if you didn't work. That way you can get these credits. Well guys, hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button down below. Make sure you guys share this video with a friend or a family member that didn't get a stimulus back in March. I know they're probably still angry with the government. Hopefully this will give them some hope and start off 2021 a little bit better than 2020. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below so you don't miss another one of my videos. And as always guys, have a nice day.